to Excellence here on the Grind Session with Tanager Sports. I'm AJ Martin, CJ Sells alongside of me. Welcome to the broadcast here on TanagerSports.tv and FIBA. Whether you're watching here in the United States or anywhere worldwide, welcome. This is the semifinals to make it to the championship game. The winner of this is going to take on Prolific Prep. We got a matchup between DME Academy and also Dream City. Dream City, they come in coached by Kyle Weaver, a person who has won twice. Uh, two times here as far as the World Championship on the grind session. Looking for his third and first with Dream City. They are talented. Both of these rosters have high major Division One prospects and even NBA potential lottery picks as well. You know, and I look at the matchups, and, and you, I mean, all across the board, you got bigs, guards matching up. You have uh, Eman, Emmanuel Steven, and Mustafa Tiam. That's a great matchup. Then you go to the backcourt, Yamari Bell and Gabe Pickens. You've got Savo and Ike. I mean, yeah. it just goes on and on. Alejandro against Babatunde. So I'm really looking forward to this one. Savo, Trezik, just a junior, top 100 kid, getting offers and looks from Kentucky, UCLA, Kansas, just to name a few. And then you got on the other side of things, Ike Olazi, who's also an underclassman. He's a sophomore. A lot of people are saying he looks a lot like Western Westbrook yeah. with a jump shot. We've seen more of that out of him as of late. Yep, he is a talent, just a sophomore. Salvo is a junior, so the talent that's going to be out here is underclassmen. We've got seniors. Emmanuel Steven, we mentioned earlier, will play his college basketball at the University of Arizona in Tucson. So we are loaded with talent. We talked in our first boys game uh, about dudes, and both of these teams got some dudes, boy, I tell you. That is for sure. The winner is going to take play prolific tomorrow for a world championship here on the grind session as we get started on the scoreboard. The home team is going to be Dream City as they're the number two seed. The road will be DME as they're the number three seed. This is DME Academy's third year here on the grind session. Dream City's fifth year here on the grind session. As previously mentioned, Kyle Weaver won a grind session world championship back in 2017 with Hillcrest and in 2019 with Bella Vista. And he was the coach of the year in 2022. DME out of Daytona, Florida, Dream City out of Glendale, Arizona. So we'll get set and ready to roll here as Tim set the jump ball. And by the way, Mustafa Tim was talking with Coach today. He's only been playing basketball for a year and a half. Wow. It's you talk about a high prospect. He's just a junior, number 52 in black, 7'2", seven, seven legit 7-footer. Phenomenal kid. Averaging 17 points a ball game. And Savo starts out on Travis Terrain, and Gabe Pickens is going to get called for a foul right out of the gate here. So first possession coming up here for DME. Savo running the point. E-Man's got to stay out of foul trouble for Absolutely. Dream City. Alejandro with a rebound. Emmanuel Steven has a, has a tendency to get in some early foul trouble. Alejandro Avila is knocking down the three here for Dream City to get them on the board. E-Man needs to be on the floor playing minutes. He's going to be guarding Baba Tunde. Sabo. And I'll be out of bounds and it'll stay with DME. Dream City active on defense here early. Tim with the rebound. Mustafa back out to Bell. So they get organized. E-Man. Underneath to the throw down by Emmanuel Stevens. The Arizona commit. 
That's going strong. Absolutely. You hear that term a lot with big men. Go strong. Mm -hmm. E-Man went strong. So Alejandro is going to guard Tim. E-Man on Duradola. I like oh, it. Tough finish there like by it. Mustafa. He's going to have a little bit of a size advantage over Avilas. And Bell going to be called for the early foul there. It's going to be two team fouls on DME. I think it's one and one. Okay. Five two our score early. Here's Sabo. Oh, we got to go ahead and finish that. Yeah. Just lay that up. He tried to drop that off to yeah. Tim. E man playing some defense. Alejandro in there as well. Just go ahead and shoot it. If you get your shot blocked, then you get your shot blocked. Here's Travis, Ike Olazi, boom. He's getting so much better. That jump More shot. consistent yep. uh, from beyond the arc. The shot's always been there, the percentage hasn't been. 8-2 our score. And DME just can't hold on to the ball right now. A little discombobulated on the offensive side. They had a little bit of nerves. You can almost kind of sense it. Ike Olazi. Sabo. What, what he thought was the rebound. And a timeout call by DME. And Dream City. Our score. Dream City off to a great start. That's what they wanted, obviously. Ike with the three. Alejandro with a three. E-Man, those two dunks has four points and two rebounds. And the early going and playing great defense. DME just one of four from the field. Mustafa Tiam with the only two. And if you're Dream City, you couldn't ask for a better start. That's right. And the girls are out in force. Hey, you think about some of the turnovers here for DME. You know, ball slipping through your hand, open guys, kind of overpassing a little bit. Savos probably had a couple layups he could have taken, but made, you know, wanted to make the, the extra pass. So you just got to settle into this game if you're DME. But again, this is a team that was battle tested too in Dream City. There's a lot of returning players from a year ago on this Dream City team. We started the clock before anybody touched the basketball. So these two teams have played twice this year. Mm -hmm. One grind session event in Daytona that you called by yourself because I wasn't around. And Dream City won that one in overtime. Dream City won it in overtime, and then they played in a another event, non-grind event, where DME won that ball game. And they nearly throw that ball away. So familiar with each other. There's Mustafa Tiam here with him. Baba Tude coming off, and here's Savo back to. Mustafa skip past the Robinson. Hadn't mentioned his name yet. He tries to oh, throw wow. it down and a big finish by Robinson. Wow. Oh, goodness. Was he up there? E man with the foul. Wow. I was talking with Jalen before the ball game. He missed part of the DME season with a stress fracture in his foot. And Actually played a while on that thing yeah, before he, he realized yeah, he, he yeah, had one. He did in Daytona. And uh, he said, 
every once in a while, be a little soreness in his ankle and foot, trying to get back to where he's 100%. Pickett inside Alejandro. Oh, the drop off to Ike Olazi. And he oh, finishes oh. it. Ike Olazi. My goodness. He says Jalen's got a circus shot. So do I. How about today? And that's a turnover. Ike going to go up for this one. He going up for this one. Watch ahead. My goodness. 14, the five. Block, that's two on game. So Lou Cochran is gonna come into the ball game. Gabe with two quick ones here. In the first four minutes of play. Mm. It's a slow start here for DME in this first quarter. Now the young fellow that just checked in 13 in the white uniform, Luke Cochran, young fellow can shoot it. Despite that hair in his face. <laughs> Sometimes I wonder what they can see. Right. So Ike will take over the point guard duties here. We've seen him play the point before. Chris Katange will draw the defensive assignment on him. Ike Olazee stepping feeling back it, huh? in space. Yeah, you can tell. Playing with tremendous amount of confidence. Alejandro Avila is doing what Big Fundamental does. Alejandro. Got his St. Patty Day shoes on out there today, too. Sporting the green. There's Mustafa to you. Alejandro, again. Battle for the rebound, and these guys hustle. He man, mm -hmm. selling out trying to save that. Taco's gonna check in for him. But Velasquez checking in here for DME as well. We've seen DME struggle at times on offense. Budalaskis can knock a triple down, we'll see if Coach Matt tries to run something for him. Start for the Eagles. Couldn't have been better. Oh, it's all foul there. Travis Terrain. Savo will go to the free throw line to shoot three. Savo, one of two from the line the first time he was there. Yep, he's got three shots coming up. Yep. These are the type of plays, too, that can get a team going. I mean, see the ball go in a little mm -hmm. bit if you're DME. You get a little blow physically yep. here. Get this in the single digits. One more. I mean, Taco is a big young fella, and look at him next to Tim. He, mm -hmm. Mustafa's got three inches on him. Eighteen nine, our score. Here's Ike Olazi, sporting the new brace, new look. 
Blue. Inside. Alejandro. Get out. That's right. Sabo ahead, always up on the swivel. For DME, he's going to have to do it at that end of the floor. Oh. Robinson. Wow. Eighteen, eleven. It's Ike. All is here. In the space. Blocked by Mustafa. All for Taco. Hey, we gotta get it DME's kind of weathered the storm a little bit here. Down seven, but with the basketball. Mustafa. Budalaskis, big shot. We'll put him in the game for offense. 18-14, mm -hmm. our score, back and forth they go. We're in for a heavyweight bout, folks. Luke, inside the taco, and he throws it down. Great execution there from Dream City. Nobody with help defense for DME. That ball is tipped inside to Mustafa in the right hand. It goes for Mustafa. See him. I love that aggressiveness on offense there. Mustafa got a height advantage over somebody that's going to be guarding him. Oh, Taco wide open. Mm. Good finish there by yeah. Taco. They switched out on defense. Taco rolled to the bucket. Mm -hmm. It took a while, but they got him. He was open. Savo picks up his dribble here. Up high, they go back into Mustafa. Mustafa having a good game so far. Robinson, that won't go. The follow for the rebound and get fouled and free throws coming here for DME. Jalen created that following his missed shot and getting a hand on that offensive rebound. Tipping it to Chris Katenge. Luke Cochran rebounding the missed free throw. So 22 17 under a minute. Luke. It's five to one. For the last kiss, he'll pick, pick up his dribble. Oh, my. Finish. Chris Katenga with the left 22 hand. 22 19. Luke coming off that horse. And we'll get some subs into the game. It's going to be a turnover. Back to DME. DME basketball, they've got a chance to tie this up. They got the game of to, runs. Yeah, they got off to a rocky start. All the time. Settled down a little bit here on offense. and. Tough pass. Walters, the freshman. Spinning, losing the handle. Losing it. it again. Somehow getting it off and. Shoot it, shoot it, shoot it. Count it. Yeah, there Count it goes. It. High level basketball, folks. 22 19 after, I'm sorry, 25 19 after one. We'll be back. This is the grind session.
So we're getting set and ready to go here for the second quarter, 25-19. Uh, it's been a game of runs. What a so shot. Twin City, what a fantastic start to the ball game. DME gets it within a, a few, and then a last second shot as Savo splits there, and that's a good bucket there. But back and forth they go. Great players, off to a great start. And that finish at the end of the first quarter, Taco catching that long pass, and the coaching staff hollering, shoot. He found Gabe Pickens, and Gabe hit the 45-footer. Tries to get it inside of Taco. That's knocked away. Here's Savo in transition, oh. and Budulaskis just kind of slows down a I bit. I was going to say, I don't know if he stopped running because uh, Savo looked away, and Budulaskis said, okay, he's not throwing that to me. You go get open, you Savo will yeah, find you. On the, you're on his team. You have to keep your hands ready. And go get open, and he'll find For you. For 94 feet. <laughs> on the illegal screen, that's going to be two. Going to be two fouls now on Eman. Alejandro Avilas will check in for Emmanuel Steven. Baba today, wow. strong finish. Falling out of bounds, able to get that shot up against the big men. Duradola's first bucket of the ball game. Oh, oh man. The length of Mustafa. The length of Mustafa is, came into play there, big time. Trying to get the shot clock worked out here. Yeah, well, the ball didn't hit the rim. It was it was rejected where it came off the backboard. The only thing that hit was Mustafa's right hand. So we're going in 14. Hi, Kalazi. It's Walters, Mustafa TM knocking it down, tying the ball game. We're tied at 25. Catch and shoot for the big fella. He's yep. got six now. There's Luke. It goes here. I warned you when he walked in the game. Absolutely. You got Yep, that's the turnover, unforced turnover. Stepping over the line there. Remember when we were in Phoenix for the event and, and the Dream City boys during a girls game, how active they were on the sidelines, the yes, bench? And yes. The girls are doing that now for the boys over Absolutely. here in the section. Over there behind that grind and FIBA sign, the girls are bringing that energy for the boys game. Alejandro Aviles, the kid from Puerto Rico, step away, and it's good. 27. 30-25 is the score. Babatunde inside. 
Alejandro with good defense to rein the rebound. It's I. Tries to make the extra pass. Ball's loose. Luke, Alejandro, good. We get a timeout call by Dream City. 32-25. Woo. Catch your breath. I mean, we're back and forth, back and forth. What a fun matchup this is. Are you kidding is. me? One more ball game yep. to go. The winner of this gets prolific prep tomorrow in the boys championship game, the men's championship game. These are men playing basketball out here. Bella Vista girls winning the game before this one, so they're waiting for example, Academy and Fort Erie's girls to play to see who they will get in the championship game. Dream City Alejandro with seven points and three rebounds off to a good start. Ike Olazie has seven points. Taco has four, Eman has four. Mustafa Tiam, six points. Jalen Robinson with five for DME. Budalaskis with a three. Babatunde, bucket inside. Savo's got six. Four of those coming from the free throw line. Here's Savo. Oh, wow. I think he was going to pass the basketball because he said something to a teammate. Wow. Kyle's been working on that. Oh, one yeah, too. he has. He has. His kids do the same thing. <laughs> so zone for DME here. Find Luke Cochran if you're DME. Mm. Big shot there by Luke. Back to a 10 point game here for Dream City. Wow, that young fella came to play tonight. He can shoot. Where's the offense gonna come from? from DME. Mustafa gambles there as that rattles off the rip. Taco with the rebound. Got back and recovered well, Taco did. He's the one that went for that steal at the top of the key. If you're DME, find 13 in the white. You have got to get the ball to Luke Cochran. There he is. Alejandro with it at the top of the key. Savo sitting down on defense. That's off Savo with the rebound. Here comes DME. Babatunde with it, trying to get it inside to Mustafa, and he'll get fouled. He'll go to the line with an opportunity to shoot, too. Mustafa really active on the offense. Taco with the foul, Mustafa. Three of five from the field here in the early going. Team shooting two. Kamani Walters and Chris Katenga will check back in for DME. So empty trip there for DME. I need every bucket, man. Every point. Everything matters. Season on the line for these teams. Here's Alejandro. Shaft step. Loses the handle.
It's going to be white basketball. So Green City will keep possession. Eight on the shot clock. Five to go here on the shot clock. Oh, oh my God. Just Ridiculous. Like just like Kyle Ridiculous. Weaver drew it up, huh? Jamari Bell with a strong drive. Ike mm -hmm. Olazi with the foul. And Jamari will shoot some free throws here. Young fella. Five foot ten senior from D-Land, Florida. Again. That's struggling from the free yeah. throw line. They've Again. missed. I want to say their last three, three of their last four at least. Six of 11 now in the ball game. And at the end of this game, when it's close, you're going to want some of those missed I think free throws. There's only been one foul called on TME the entire game. I think so. Inbound the taco here as he's trying to find a guard. He gets it over to Ike. Quick pass ahead to Travis Terrain. Alejandro. Luke. That's off, but follows his own miss, gets their offensive rebound. Travis Terrain steps out of bounds. defense there by Dream City. Here's Luke. He'll slow it down a little bit here for Dream City. 325 to go in the second quarter. He didn't stay in that zone for a real long time. Mm -mm. And Luke knocks it down. All Dream City right now. Luke with 11 in the ball game. Three of four from deep. Mustafa, tough pass. Luke playing defense as well. Oh, oh that's goaltending. Oh, oh, oh. That's goaltending bad. Oh, man. That was like bang, bang. You can hear it. So Kamani Walters will go to the free throw line to shoot a couple here. And Calvin Murphy the third gonna check in for the Eagles. Got them both. Yeah, that was a missed goaltending call on that. I last believe possession. it was. Oh, there's no belief. It was like boom, boom. Like you heard the glass, <laughs> then you heard the slap of the ball. It, it wasn't even like it wasn't even. <laughs> it wasn't even something. Chris can pull that replay up for us when we get a dead mm -hmm. ball action or something. You see that. Oh, oh. man. Ike faked his own teammate out. Yep. Chris Sabo backing down the smaller defender, still coming up short. Alejandro Aviles with the rebound. Oh, Alejandro's got five rebounds now. Go! Ike! Rebound! Taco! Ike! Run our offense! 
find you a guard, Mustafa. Sabo. Inside, Baba oh. Tude. I gotta shoot that. I gotta be ready to shoot okay. that. And they're gonna get him for hooking. Babatunde, that is the second foul now on DME in this ball game. Taco. Again, this pressure. DME doing a good job pressuring that inbound play. Absolutely. Robinson, Mustafa, over the bell. Plenty of time on the shot clock. Baba Tude inside, can't get it to go. Duradola getting his own rebound. And that's that foul's going to be on Taco. And Babatunde Duradola will go to the free throw line. The young fella is a junior from Toronto, Canada. DME in their free throws. Free throws are becoming an issue. Murphy the third. Travel. <laughs> Travis Terrain will check back in. Stuff is there. Here's Travis, terrain. No go there. DME one of six from Tell three you what, point There's range. a little opening here. DME could get some kind of execution. Dream City has not got a bucket in a while, but everything is sloppy here. We'll get a jump ball, and it'll stay with DME. Shot clock at 15. Baba Tude. Great block. Good block there by Alejandro. Big bucket there by Bell. Much needed field goal by DME. They get it under 10. They get a stop here. Mm -hmm. and get the basketball back and score. They'll go into the oh, locker room. Yep. Just a silly turnover there. They'll go into the locker room feeling much better about themselves. They go quick, they can go two for one. We've been calling timeout, and the referee hands the ball to Savo. Advance the basketball. Matt Panaggio with the second timeout. We'll listen in on their huddle. Hey, here's the deal good about this timeout. After they advance it, you can go for a two for one right now with as much time left on the clock. Bounce it right back to Savo. Savo, try to turn that corner when you stop the screen. You guys got it? All right. We're. 
and you hear exactly what I was yep. just mentioning. Tom I used to advance it. It's not just to get the ball up before, right. but the opportunity to Save cut down time, time yep. to go for two for one. 10 of 26 DME is from the field. Two of seven from deep. Dream City is 17 of 30 from the field. Seven of 14 from three point range. And they want to advance the basketball to scoreboard side of the floor. And if you listened in, they're going to try to get Savo on a drive. Hey, Savo. Turn the corner here. Savo down the lane and just couldn't complete that. Great execution. Yep. Exactly what Matt drew up. Just not able to finish. 41-32. Now, this bucket here, down nine. They go up double digits. Luke. Won't go, the tip yeah. is good. Travis Terrain, give him credit for that one. So Travis makes it a 43-32 game. We're here for the coaches coming up here in just a bit. This is the grind session. Yeah, but it's, they miss goaltending and three fouls down there. I got you. I got Coach Kyle Weaver with me. All right, 11 point lead right now at the half. Tell me what you're telling your guys right here. Stay focused. Uh, you've been in this position before. So what are you telling your guys right now? Biggest thing, loose balls. Um, loose balls were fouling too much. Uh, they probably shot 16, 18 free throws to zero right now, which is crazy. I've never heard that stat in my life. But um, they're, they're going to the free throw line too much. That's what's going on right now. And we got it. We got to stop fouling. Appreciate it, Coach. Yeah, thank you. Yes, sir. All right, so they got 18 more minutes in the second half. All right, one team executing the game plan almost to a T. All right, other than diving on the ground for loose balls, giving up second chance points. The other team going to have to re-execute the game plan or come up with a new one in the second second half. All right, DME has won the last two matchups this season. But Dream City said we ain't going for the third one. All right, two strikes, ain't no three strikes, you're out. We'll see what happens in the second half.
Mustafa Tiam, good first half, six points, 
two rebounds for DME. And it'll be Eagles basketball as we get started here in the second half. Oh, we're going to be joined by hey new daddy, new hey daddy, Mikey Davis. Hey -o, hey -o. How are you, bro? I'm good. How you doing? I'm Watching good. some good basketball. Oh, are you kidding? This is great. Hey, Pickens. Pickens been playing great the past couple of weeks. This is big boy basketball inside there. You got two seven-footers matched up against each other. You know they're going to take this game serious. Salvo's got to turn that corner, be aggressive to shoot the layup. There he goes, finally gets him a three. Is that a layup right there? That, for him, maybe. Pretty much. <laughs> Cuts the lead to eight. Every time they cut it, Dream City finds a way to rush right back off. Yeah. I was talking with Fort Erie girls coaches, and they said, I thought it was a four or five point game, and I said it was. And before you know it, Dream City was back up a dozen. Yeah. A Baker's dozen. I wonder if Baba Tunde is going to get it going here in the second half. Yeah, he's you know, those bigs for Dream City. Emmanuel's playing great today. Uh, Alejandro is very consistent. You see this kind of game out of him night in, night out. Foul called on Ikenna. They're going to take it out of bounds. Say New look I wasn't shooting. New look Ikenna. Yeah, got the braids going. Did you help him out there? Nah, he got the Iverson vibes going. You know those shoes he has on? Those just came out like three days ago. Really? Yeah, that's the newest colorway <laughs> of the Anthony Edwards. Literally just came out. Look at Savo. And a foul. That's going to be three on Gabe. Third foul on Pickens. And Savo Rezgic. Gabriel's getting coached up by one of the assistants. Uh, Coach B.A. and you see Yamari coming over and standing right yeah, beside him listening to everything that's going on. <laughs> like, what you telling him? I want to know. You know, at this point, we always talk about the players. We don't give our coaches enough credit. No. Our coaches are so good. Oh, man. They are so well prepared. Not just, not just head coaches. Yeah, just watching film, everybody, the staffs that know the plays, calling out plays. Savo two for two so far gets one more. As you say that, you know, Prolific Prep hasn't left the gym. Their yeah. coaches haven't left the gym since their game earlier, and they're here to try to get the best scout that they can on this game right here. And they know, I mean, they know these teams as well as anybody. They've played them, but yet they're still going to stay here and see if they maybe see something new. It's March, baby. Everybody plays their best ball in March, except for the Duke Blue Devils. <laughs> Alejandro with the fall away. Yamari with the rebound. He's made that shot numerous times this game. That one doesn't fall, though. I like this matchup between Baba Tunde and Alejandro. Yeah. Yamari Bell with another one. Mm. Looked good. Savo with the offensive board. Mustafa inside. Oh, he's got big time mismatch. They've got to get. Oh, that means oh. Mustafa has a mismatch too. Yeah, that's a, that's the one I meant, and and Alejandro switched over. This is insane. This is insane. And Eman, Emmanuel, Stephen, going to be called for his third personal foul. The future Arizona Wildcat. Yep, he's played a good game so far. Who the Wildcats not playing well in March? Well. Oh, my goodness. Savo with a deep one. Where's AJ at? Sips for Savo. <laughs> I don't know. DME might want Mikey to stay. <laughs> <laughs> They've been on a run since yeah. he's had my headset on, he, right? He grabbed the headset, and yep. DME went on a run. Mari Bell going to be called for the foul there. Coach Matt might be upset that AJ's back. I don't know. Pickens. 41. Sabo got a hand on that. Nine to go here on the shot clock. 641 left in this quarter again. It's been DME taking body shots from Dream City, but they keep answering. 
a 9-0 to start the quarter. Dream City hadn't scored. Pickens, Alejandro, good finish. Oh, left hand, good left hand from Alejandro. Alejandro with 11 in the ball game, five of 11 from the field. Oh, good pass. What a pass. Great help defense, though, by Eman. Mustafa. Oh, good basketball right there. I can tell you, Dream City's perfect from the line. Why? Well, uh -huh. Because I hadn't a free throw. You haven't missed one yet. 41, I'm sorry, 45, 41. Sabo, inside. Good ball movement. Jalen Robinson missing the wide open three. And I, I couldn't oh. get it to go, and it'll stay. Nope, it'll go to DME. Luke Cochran, we're gonna check back into the ball game. Luke, three of five from deep in the first half, 11 points, four rebounds. Outstanding first half for Luke. 41, or I'm sorry, 45, 41, here's Sabo. Having himself another good ball game. What else is new? He's got 15 points. Dream City. That rattles in and out. Lance Stevens with a big rebound. He'll stay on this end. Babatunde, Duradola, going to be called for that foul. E-Man doing some work on the offensive glass. Luke, good luck. We talked about it a couple of broadcasts ago. We talked about having your hands and feet ready to shoot. Luke Cochran does, boy. Wow, there's got to be a basket interference or something there. You allowed to just go up there and grab the rim? 47 41, <laughs> four and a half to go in this third quarter. Oh, back door. Back door. Mm. Right there, you just need to finish. Yep. Not the highlight dunk. Alejandro Aviles from the short quarter. Robinson with the rebound. And I'm not picking on Robinson, but it's got to be a sure thing. And this type of game. Mustafa. In and out there. Luke, work it inside, tough pass. It's going to be a kick ball. Jalen Robinson and Ike Alozzi going to check out the game, get some needed rest. Gabe not able to get the triple to go. Not a good pass from Savo. Got to value those possessions. Turnover. And the ball is knocked out of bounds. It'll stay with DME. Hey. 
talking about how good our coaches are. They call the play, and Kyle mm -hmm. Weaver jumps up and says it's a clear out. Yeah. He knows exactly what they're doing. And Bob, two day and one opportunity coming up. And Eman, Emmanuel, going to be called for the foul. And Taco will check in for him, the two-headed monster that Dream City has, the bigs inside, Taco. And E. Stop. Let's go. Stop. Stop. We good. We good. Stop. <laughs> Man, I'm not liking that last call, but. We still have a shot free throw. We still have a shot one. Yeah, I think they did. We got shooter. Early. Stay. Stay. The winner of this one plays the number one seed prolific prep crew. Wow, that's an errant pass that Luke Cochran picks up and drives and hits the layup. 49-44. Budalaskis. Inside. Chris Katenge with a great offensive rebound. And enforced that. What a game. Here's Pickens. Taco setting that screen. Good look inside. It's just Taco rolling after setting that pick. Shooter guarding the shooter there. Budalakis, Budalakis clearing him out. Alejandro sitting down defensively. And he turns his angle. And Chris again, and no. Uh, mm. Yeah, but he landed on defender's foot. Baba Tunde is, we're gonna have a trainer. Baba Tunde in that right ankle. The teams will go to their benches and we'll get a chance to look at some numbers here. Luke Cochran and Alejandro Vilas each with 13. Ike Alozi with 10 for Dream City. Savo, the only one in double figures for DME. And Baba Tunde. Gonna hobble off. Right ankle. Baba Tunde hobbles off with six points and five rebounds. They'll have to replace his size on the inside. Jalen Robinson will check back in the game for DME. Fifty-one forty-four. Unfortunate to see Baba Tude go down there. Ike Olazi with that offensive rebound. Back to Ike. They'll be patient. And a shot clock violation. Mm -hmm. Turnover by Dream City. Over number 11 for the Eagles. Here's Sabo. Horns look really extended out. 
Savo. Won't go there. 51-44. Oh, taco. taco inside. And there's oh. a foul. Nothing. Nothing. I believe the foul is going to be on Lebon. Oh, Taco's going to get called, yeah. And it'll be DME basketball. Yeah. This is not believable. You no, we're going to shoot free throws. That's going to be five. That's all I'm asking. So Jalen Robinson will go to the free throw line to shoot some free throws. Get in there. Mike. Mike. 14 of 21 from yeah. the free throw well, line. Here's the Miami. amazing stat. They, they've shot 21 free throws. They're and, plus 22 and, after this one. And Dream City shot zero free throws. And they missed That's another. 22 free throws. 22. They're plus 22, 22 to zero. on the free throw side. I, I don't know if I've ever seen that before. That's rare. I'm not saying. Not this level of basketball. This was a bad, but that's just rare to see in a ball game. I mean, Alejandro Avilas. 10 point and the Dream City's up by 10. They led by 11 at halftime. DME got within a couple. Now they're back up. Yamari blocked by Alejandro. It'll be good if it goes. Oh my God. 54 44 after three. We'll be back. This is the grind section. So DME won the quarter, 13 to 12. It'll be their basketball down 10 as the fourth and final quarter of this one is underway. Horns look here, Bell with it. Mustafa, oh, they missed it. Yep, yeah, they missed that one. That ball got to move. No, 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 though. That's that ball hit the rim. Yeah. We had ball. I don't white even know ball. what the. White white ball, white ball, white ball. White ball. Yes, sir. Come on. Yeah, and, and you can't reset the 24 second shot clock until you know who's, who's got, got the possession. rebound. Yeah. I thought it was off black anyway. <laughs> well, Regardless, it, it I mean, be white you know, ball. you miss the shot and the ball rolls around and you can't reset it until somebody picks it up because yeah. it, it either goes to 14 or 24. Yeah. And so the horn blows and that's nothing. You just keep playing until. Oh, this is. Uh oh, there we go.
just let's just play basketball here, Mr. Official. We have possession. Hey, Chris. We have possession. No, no, I get it. I get it. Trying to check the We have possession. I'm trying to check the fouls. New ref, ref, ref. He needs to give you an explanation. No, he has the ball. What's going on? He's going on. He's So they've changed the call, and we'll give it to DME. Can we look at it? Please, can we look at it? Can we just look at it for just for a second? Mike, can we look at it? I'm one hundred percent sure Black had the ball because when they shot it, he stopped and said, "It's here," and Black had the ball. Zero has possession. Take a look. Let's go. We good. We good. We good. This is crazy. Twenty freaking three to zero on free throws. Fifty-four. 44. I just don't know why you wouldn't look, look at, at it, it to be sure. Yeah, just to know you got it right. And there's a foul on Chris Katenge. I'd like to see the replay on that if yeah. Chris got it. I mean, just for that. Yeah, I mean. I just don't like an official. I thought the effect. ball went out of bounds, too. Yeah. I mean, I could be wrong. I, that's why I, I want to see the replay. I, that whole thing was a little bizarre. Well, just the, the uh, ego of an official that I yes. got it, and, and instead of trying to get it correct, I mean, I know and he you, may have got it correct. Yeah, we I don't know. Say, but I know you say I got it right, but why not uh, double check? Here's the replay. The foul's going to be on Yamari Bell. We're going to see the replay here. Okay, All right, so there's, there's the clock. And it, it hits, hits the, the rim, rim, so it resets. But see, I thought it was just out of bounds. Well, it goes out of bounds. They right they there. tipped it back in, and then he's he stopped in play. So nobody had it actually. So why was he stopping play? Because the horn went off on the shot clock. Uh, but it was already re. Yeah. Set. See? Oh man, that was, yeah, that was. That should have been jump ball. Worst case scenario. Ooh, Cochran. Good work, Chris. Thanks for the replay. That was foul. <laughs> Man. Hi, right, Colizzi. Mm. Mustafa. TM with a rebound. That's five for him now. Sabo, he may have got hit on the wrist too. Nobody has scored here in the first two minutes of the fourth quarter. Alejandro, there ah, I go. What a ball game he's having. Alejandro with a double double. How about that? 18 and 12. Fifty-six, forty-four. Here's Sabo. Kudalaskis. Oh, oh my goodness! Good. Tough shot. Kudalaskis. <laughs> kind of forced the action there. Got that one to go. You got to run. There's Taco yeah. with the offensive rebound. You got to run Luke Cochran off the line, make him put it on the floor, and we're going to get a timeout. All right, timeout taken by DME. Let's take a timeout, too. We'll be back. This is the grind session.
They're running it. Ike! Ike! Yes! Just like I said. Oh, not having your hands ready right there. <laughs> wow. He took one point blank right off the chops. Mm. Wow. E-Man just checked into the game and picked up a foul. That's, That's his be, fifth. It's going to be his fifth. I'm not sure what he did there, but. Strong Gabe with the kick out to Ike. Oh, that's got to be a flagrant. They're going to call two shots. They're going to say he was going to the basket 24. <laughs> Jalen Robinson, and we're going to have to stop the game and award the basketball here to somebody because <laughs> this getting... is this is literally the first yeah. trip to the stripe. Yeah. And we played, uh, what have we played here? 30 and a half minutes. Yeah, these are the first two free throws of the ball game for Dream City. So Yamari Bell is going to check back in for Budalaskis. DME down 13. Oh, one of two. E-Man trying to, <laughs> trying to get uh, an Academy Award there. Oh, good block there. Oh, wow. And Ike's going to be called for the foul. Good job, boy. And that's going to be his third. second team foul, his third. Get down. Get down. Dave, get down. Ale, come. Ale. Sabo, yes, going to work. Yes, Projecting that screen and travel, yes. travel. Yes. Hey. And DME's going to pick up full court. Dream City. Well, they attack it. Now they bring it back out and try to set something up here. Gabe. Oh, look at that. Nice find by Alejandro. Yamari Bell. I didn't know you could get up like that with the basketball. I know. There's Bell up in the side of Thought he got up before he dribbled it, but. Walters. Oh. Over to Mustafa. Mustafa. Comes that right handed Steve. hook. Oh. Big throw down by Robinson. That young man's a high flyer. And that's going to be a turnover. Or it didn't go out of bounds, Come apparently. Out. Come out! Come out! Come out! It does. You get into That is a dumb rule. That's a bailout rule, bro. Dream City. Still got 10. We'll call a timeout. That's a bailout. We got to change that. The timeout buys you in 10 more seconds. Yeah, make a note. That, that's got to be changed. That's a bailout. So 59, 48. Is it like that in college too? So. Is it? Alejandro Vilas with 18 points and 13 rebounds in this ball game. Luke Cochran 13 and six. Ike Olazi 11 and five. Eman has four points and seven rebounds. Jalen Robinson with that throw down was 
Seven points and six rebounds now for the senior that's headed for Richmond. We live, baby. We are. Yes. We live. Alejandro Avalez, X Factor. I agree. He's had a big game here in this one. The Puerto Rican assassin. <laughs> Here's some pressure here being put on by DME. Somebody's going to go long. They were thinking about it. Right. Chicago just lost their quarterback today. Straight into the Pittsburgh Steelers. Is that what happened? Justin Fields, Pittsburgh wow. Steelers. Alejandro, and that rattles in. Over a hot flyer and a second X factor, Y factor. Absolutely. 20 and 13. 61 48. Here's Savo Robinson. Inside to Mustafa. And that's going to be a foul there on Alejandro. That's going to be three team fouls. I think, I think Kyle's, Kyle's happy now that they got their first free throws of the game. <laughs> now it's way big difference yeah, here. Now he's gotten two. <laughs> I haven't heard him complain again. They're plus 20. That's us. That's us. I like get down. Get down. And again, with the 24-second shot clock, there's still plenty of possessions for DME to maybe make a run. And, you know, they've given up 61 points. It's not like they're horrible. It's not like, they, you know, they've given up 80 or something. Yeah. Again, there's the opportunity to get it with this end. Impeccable vision. Yep. I don't think we've ever had a three-man crew. The foul was on Alejandro. They reported 13. It was on 12. No. Chris Katenge will check in and Mustafa Tiam, who has eight points, is 0 of 2 from the free throw line. Ale line. Mustafa misses a free throw and they are 14 of 23. Nine missed free throws for DME. 11 point lead here for Dream City. Luke pulling up at the elbow. Mustafa just flying out of nowhere wow. to grab. That reach. Swat that one away. That wingspan. Impressive. I go Z. Ike will go to the free throw line. He was one of two last time. Ike with 11 points and six rebounds. Three assists in this one. And Ike gets at him to rattle home. Gets them both. Dream City is now three of four from the free throw line. There's a measles outbreak in Chicago right now. So here's Bell, Sabo, off the floppy action. Mel Hughes with the offensive rebound. Good hustle by both these teams. Pickens. Alejandro and. Call that on Mustafa Tiam. Alejandro to the free throw line. Alejandro nine of 18 from the field, two of five from deep. These will be his first free throws. There's a hotel here somewhere that has 98. Alejandro now 21 and 14 on the ball game. Make it 22. A heck of a ball game from the senior. Yomari Bell. Talk about getting downhill and a little out of control. Ike 
Taking it strong right at him. Absolutely. Oh no, Ike's been all over the place. Sabo. Good job, Good Yeah, I like Ike. He's, he's got his paws all over the place. Nothing easy. Talk, talk. Get down. Real little. Sabo for two. Savo now has 17 in the ball game. Flow, 67-52, Dream City in control here. <laughs> 67 52. 152 to go here in this ball game. Winner is going to move on and play prolific prep. Right now, looking like the two best teams in our Power Conference League. Now we all have to season. look at the game time for tomorrow. There's Sabo working off that horns. Look here. And a finish there. The game will be at 7.30 tomorrow night, Central Time. Girls Championship at 5, boys at 7.30. I hope we brought some extra nets. <laughs> no, don't foul now. Oh. Shot clock in three. Oh, and big bucket. Alejandro uh, with the nail. He's got numbers. He's got 24 and 14. Might have to interview too, Mikey. <laughs> 24 and 14 for Alejandro. And big a turnover. No. I, and this look out. Oh, and he finishes. Yamari Bell, the foul. And that's going to all but do it, I believe, yeah. for the Eagles. Absolutely. So they will get another shot at prolific prep. They are 0-2 against the crew this year. A great run here by DME. They're not going to let Sam come in the game. He's going to come for the shooter. And Ike will go to the line, trying to add to his numbers 17 and 7 today. Make it 18. And Sam Chukwuma will come in for Ike. He'll sit down with. 18 points and seven rebounds in the ball game tonight for Ike. Mel Hughes on the drive. Play. Amen. E Amen. E says Scott Weaver didn't want a shot. And Amen's e like, I didn't hear you. <laughs> so the final score is going to be 72 54. Dream City will move on and play prolific prep tomorrow at 7 30, right here on TanagerSports.tv on the FIBA YouTube channel for a grind session. World Championship. We'll have an interview with the player of the game coming up in just a bit. This is the grind session.
Popping. All right, I got Ikena Lozzi. I'm sorry, Ikena Iverson. The headband and the braids. Hey, Oh my God, it's the one. It's the one. 15, seven, and three. You and Ale played great games today, but that ain't it. Luke's game didn't transition to the stat sheet, but he played a heck of a game. Grabbing rebounds, busting his tail, diving on the floor for loose balls. Big fella. Both big fellas. Yes, sir. Both big fellas. Taco kept his head today. Played a great game. All right, that's what you need. You're clicking on all cylinders right now. Both teams in the championship game is scary. Dream City prolific. I know y'all want to get back. Talk to me. We want all that. We've been waiting for it. We've been talking about all year. But we had to face what's in front of us first. That which was DME. I mean, we did what we had to do, you know. And now we got him. So we got we got real You feel me? Yeah. After going one and one with them during the season, came out, 18 point dub, take care of business. What was the game plan? I mean, uh, we came out, we came out with the same strategy, you know, from the last time. But we knew the last time, you know, we had, we had, we had uh, lapses in the top quarter, you know, coming in the top quarter, we had lapses. So we, we talked, we went back to look, and we said, no, we zero zero again. It's back from the top. We started all over. Come on, and we did it. Oh, this one real quick. Hold on, on. I'll be right back. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. What are you doing? What are you doing? Hey, you want to hear me? Hey, you want to hear me? It's Ikena Iverson. Yes, sir. All right, and Mike Iverson. We here. All right, it's the one. Yes, sir. One more. Appreciate you, man. It's going to be a great game tomorrow. Stay tuned. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. 12 minutes. All right. I'll, I'll, <laughs> yeah, sir. Good. Good if it goes. 